In this video, I'm going to show you how to break your vectors and the components when doing ramp problems using trigonometry. Okay. So in order to do that, we need to do some trigonometry. So this was our ramp and block. We already said the normal and the friction are already in the y and negative x directions respectively. So now we only have to break our gravitational force into components. So kind of the reason I drew it like that is now this Left side of this triangle is our gravitational force. And we have this angle theta here. Now, when you want to break a vector into components, the vector needs to be on the hypotenuse of whatever triangle you're trying to make. So this triangle is only going to help us to define this angle phi as 90 degrees minus theta. Okay. So now I have the gravitational force pointing down. If I want the x and y components of that gravitational force, I would need another right triangle. So now with gravitational force as the hypotenuse, let's test my Heart skills. There's your right triangle. So now we've defined this angle phi. So this is the angle between the gravitational force, which points straight down, and the angle along the ramp phi. So then this angle. The other angle in this right triangle is going to be theta. So now the, it's the x component there, and then this is the y component, the gravitational force. So let me draw. Draw this bigger. So we had gravitational force. And we're breaking that into the X and the Y components. Theta down there. So now if you wanted the x component of the gravity vector, you would do sine of theta equals opposite over hypotenuse, so fgx over fg. So now fgx equals fg sine theta, cosine theta equals op, uh, adjacent over hypotenuse, so fgy over force of gravity. So now the y component of gravity is 
FG cosine theta. And then if we replace the force of gravity with M times G, we get that the X and Y components are MG sine theta and MG cosine theta respectively. So just a lot of trig and picture drawing to break those vectors into components. This has been a Dr. Strassbau lecture. Peep the credentials. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring the bell for notifications.